January 19th, 2021. Um, watching Fight Club, walking on the treadmill. This fucking Fight Club is actually pretty good. The first part of it is like fucking stupid as shit and it's fucking boring as shit. But the second part is like it's a fucking masterpiece. And then it ends kind of lame too. The shit reminds me a lot of what's going on. All these white dudes. <laughs> Ain't got shit to do like it is in a pandemic. Motherfuckers is all pissed off. <laughs> and they start breaking shit. <laughs> to do a domestic terrorism. That shit's going on right now. Very similar ways. Maybe these motherfuckers <laughs> at the Capitol <laughs> need to open up a fucking fight club. Start beating the shit out of each other. Fucking dumbass motherfuckers. Tell me if that shit right now don't remind you of these fucking idiots. God damn it. It's fucking dog. Get out of here! Asshole. Anyway, ain't shit happening as far as the news. The dumbest motherfucker that was at the Capitol got arrested. Or at least nomination for the dumbest motherfucker. This bitch <laughs> snatched Nancy Pelosi um, laptop out of her office. And this fucking patriot, as dipshit calls him, and dipshit's daughter, Ivanka, should be calling these motherfuckers patriots. This bitch tried to sell Nancy Pelosi's motherfucking laptop to the fucking Russians. So yeah, there you go for um, A plus for fucking patriotism. These motherfuckers suck, man. Seriously, you don't see me out there waving no motherfucking flag. But that's some trifling shit. I mean, I wave that flag as proud as anybody once this motherfucker corrects all this bullshit. This fucking nation been putting on people that look like me but these motherfuckers are the opposite of patriots man they don't care about this country it should be very fucking obvious by now they care about dear leader and who the fuck knows how many of these motherfuckers are goddamn Russian trolls online getting these idiots geeked up again I find that awful goddamn weird that out of all the fucking things that bitch could have done with the fucking laptop with her stupid ass, she tried to sell that shit to fucking Russia. So that tells you the fucking how these motherfuckers really is. Fucking pieces of shit. These fucking Republicans, man. These motherfuckers are Russian adjacent. Think about how Reagan used to be with these motherfuckers, and I did not no fucking fan of, I ain't no fan of Reagan. Can you imagine the fucking Reagan Republicans sucking Putin's dick like these fucking Republicans be doing? Kissing North Korea's ass like these fucking Republicans be doing now? These fucking Trumpists? Anyway, that's it. That's the news. Fucking inauguration tomorrow. Ain't shit gonna happen because these dumb fucks can't get their shit together and they too busy yapping about what they supposedly gonna do online. Shit's ridiculous. You gotta fucking vet the goddamn National Guard. To make sure they ain't a bunch of pieces of shit trying to fucking pull some Trump bullshit. Fucking exact opposite of fucking patriots. These fucking pieces of shit are definitely trying to ruin this country. It ain't gonna be that hard. Well, fuckers like Fox News, Newsmax, OAN, 
All these shitty fucking right wing. Terrorist creating. Fucking outlets, man. These motherfuckers need to go because they're not real news. They're only meant <laughs> to say the opposite of the news. So they can create a fucking distortion. A reality distortion field. That's what it is. Yeah, a group of motherfuckers, half of the motherfuckers almost in this country, living in a non-reality, that a fucking Australian racist piece of shit created 25 years ago. Fucking Rupert Murdoch. All this shit starts back with that motherfucker. Man, there's always been assholes and racist pieces of shit. But Fox News, man, they shit, they took that shit to a new level. And now look what we got. You got a group of motherfuckers that really believe or at least feel entitled to pretend that this fucking election was stolen. That shit doesn't happen if you don't got Fox News. This fucking reality distortion field these assholes are living in is dangerous. Fuckers need to start taking this shit more serious. It's not freedom of speech to yell fire in a fucking crowded movie theater. And these assholes geeking these fucking idiots up are basically yelling fire. Five motherfuckers got killed in that stupid ass fucking riot because you got these idiots yelling fire in a crowded fucking building. There ain't nobody doing shit about it. Shit kind of pisses me off. Because if I yell fire in a fucking crowded building, then my ass goes to jail. These fucking pieces of shit. Because they politicians. And because they have all these fucking outlets that will lie for them and say, no, you didn't see what you thought you just saw. You didn't hear what you thought you just heard. Let me tell you what you really heard. And they tell you some complete opposite stupid fucking bullshit and your dumb ass fucking believes it. This is a fucking problem, man. It's not freedom of speech. It's just a bunch of fucking assholes. Racist pieces of shit. They want to fucking split this country up.